We're sitting here in what looks like an ordinary Mini Cooper, although there's a difference. When you turn it on, you hear nothing. Battery-powered car from Hybrid Technologies. You can tell it's battery-powered because instead of a gas cap, you've got a socket where you can plug it in. All right, here we are inside the BMW Mini. Just to illustrate a point, I'm going to turn the car on, and I want, to I want you guys to hear what it sounds like. The car is on. Wouldn't it be awesome if half the vehicular traffic in Manhattan made no noise and emitted no pollution? 600 horsepower, which gives the supercar a 0 to 60 time of only 3.1 seconds. Tops out at 175 miles per hour and has a range of nearly 200 miles. <laughs> I love the sound of that engine. It feels fast because these cars have maximum torque from moment one. There's zero buildup of torque in an electric car because the motors are instant on. With a top speed of at least 120 miles per hour and a range of 200 miles, this electric Mini is a serious performer. Here. 675 from Hybrid Technologies uh, is electric powered and it has the sort of acceleration and horsepower that you'd expect from an exotic sports car. How often do you get to drive a car with uh, no gas in it? This uh, Mini Cooper now is all lithium, yet it's got the same punch, the same power, and the same thrill that, that the regular Mini Cooper has. All these vehicles... Are these cars available right now? They are. That's, that's the great thing about it. The car that we have here is actually a production model. It's not a concept. It's not a, a vision for the future. This is a reality right now. This is not a concept. This is something on the street in New York. The New York City taxi, it's an icon. This is something that's recognized throughout the world. This is the first in the world. It's, it's the world's first all-lithium taxi. It's on the streets here in Manhattan. Man Nearly 650 uh, horsepower. Oh, well, that will <laughs> get you going for sure. Yeah. Now, so well, we're back at Forbes, and uh, it looks like I've got about 90 miles left, so I'll see you guys later. But that's enough to equal a whole lot of fun, and now I want one of these things. For PopularMechanics.com, I'm Ben Chertoff.